welcome to the 2018 pre-season video. We have all kinds of stuff to give you. It's been a long time. I hear noises. I have arrived. Yes, you have. Isn't it glorious? Uh, it depends on who you're asking, but I'm sure maybe uh, you believe that it is. Are those all of your uh, gold medals? Yes. Oh. You're all right. <laughs> abrupt, it's great abrupt to be sound. back. <laughs> so, uh, uh, yeah, the commission waves. He's very, very excited about today. Yes, finally. Uh, so, what is the first item that we are going to talk about? It's been such a long time. Um, well, I think going back and looking at some of the videos, we discussed doing a segment possibly if we were the GM. If we were. If. Separate GMs. I yes. wouldn't want to do anything with him together. No. Correct. You might actually win a championship. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> True story. Mm -hmm. um, how would we or what would we do as far as trying to make changes going in? And you were kind of against this because you felt that some of the people in the league would actually take it to heart some of the things we would say. Oh, they and would. And would actually do the things we suggest. And they did. Thus making them, <laughs> thus making them better. Yeah. So mm -hmm. we're doing it after the fact. And then we're actually okay. going to reflect on okay. what they did. All right. So the first team up is your good buddy... Five Swords. <laughs> that, that sign language for Five Swords, in case you weren't sure. Yes. So, do you want to start off? If you owned his, now we're talking end of last season. Yes. Things you would do, or your comments about the team, or things mm -hmm. that you would try to improve going forward. I would have blown it up completely. That's what I would do. Really? Yes. I would start over from the from the beginning. Even with some of the young guys that are on the roster? Well, no. I mean, maybe you could keep a few of them, like an Ian Happ or a, I don't know, or an Miz Ian Happ. I mean, <laughs> do, you, do you see anybody else that you'd want to build Mizarra. a franchise around? Well, Mazzara still has okay. potential. He's not, yeah. he hasn't turned out to be the stud. No, I get it. I get it. Mazzara, maybe, maybe. Santana's maybe. not that old. Domingo, be at a great Yeah, but it's here. not just about how old you are. It's how much you produce. And I feel like that's... They're just kind of had a breakout year. Uh, yeah, thirty eighty five, but yeah, I guess I don't know. He's gonna. I again, I guess maybe it's just because I know now that he's just not gonna play that much. Well, again, you gotta take that out. I know. You gotta. I know. We gotta focus. Just take that out. I get it, but but anyway, I think okay, maybe keep a few of the young guys and get rid of all the other ones and just try to get a lot younger. And that's what I would have done. Uh, pitching wise. Um. Uh, same deal. I think there's probably like three guys in that list that looks like he tried to go younger for his pitching um, to build on. Um, I feel like he's, he had a bullpen per se. Yeah. Oh um, yeah. Bullpen's a completely separate entity. Yeah. I'm not talking about keeping that young, but um, I just wrote down that um, lacks a superstar. Yeah. On either offense or starting pitching. Like, right. there's no, like, you look at his roster and I'm like, oh man, I hope this guy doesn't go off against me. Well, I, I, Buster Posey's probably the closest thing he has. I'm not saying that that's amazing, but he's still a top catcher. I mean, yeah. it's, not, it's not debatable. It is. Is that really what you want to mm -hmm. build your team around? Is that you're the best catcher? No, but I mean, I, I would consider him a, a superstar because he is a top top at a fantasy position player. Uh, since Globo Gym loves us to use stats that are accurate, just going to give oh, you a Glo really... Globo Gym does. Yes, okay. Globo Gym. So um, we would both agree that the offense needs a major fixing. Oh, well, yeah, of course. All right, so last year, Five Swords was 10th in runs, 8th in singles, 4th in doubles, 8th in triples, 10th in home runs, 9th in RBIs, 8th in stolen bases. I mean, do you need to say more? He needs offense. Right. I would agree with that. 
Um, I also disagree with him playing Trevor Story so much. I think that's yeah. a huge average killer. I mean, it, it wasn't that apparent, though, from what he did the previous year that he would have dropped off that much. So it's hard to... I mean, maybe he could have adjusted it mid-season. Well, that's... But, I, I mean, I understand why he kept running them out there. That's the that last way. thing I have on my list as far mm -hmm. as improvements for 2018 for Five Swords. Better GM. Oh. Because I think mean. he does have... A decent roster. I think he has a playoff team. Do you mean after the trades? Because there's a lot of... No, no, no. Here. I'm saying even going by this, I think he could have made the playoffs with that roster. With better GMing. Uh, with I, don't, better I, GMing. I, I don't agree. Okay. I, I think it would still, too... Just I, I think he still would have, at best, been like just out like in that 7 or 8 okay. season. So we're going to go to our next segment, which is ads and subtractions. Oh, are we still, but we're still concentrating on him. Yes, okay. yeah, okay, yeah, we're, we're going to stay on him. Okay. So five swords added Lance Lynn. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, Lance Lynn. Yeah, added Lynn. Yeah. Lance McCullers. Right. To his pitching staff. Uh -huh. Was that enough? Was that enough to change anything? Well, you didn't actually read the Roto stats for his pitching. You just gave me all of his offensive stats. So are you saying that his pitching was just as bad as his offense? Yes, it was. It was. Um... Because that I'm not even sure about. I thought maybe his offense was so terrible that his pitching couldn't pick it up. Because I thought his I still have, was I, his pitching. I'm still looking at a lot of 5th through 10th rankings on his pitching category. Okay, so he's still really bad. Okay, that's all I need. I didn't need it. Okay. okay, so... Would you say that's enough of an upgrade, though, to add to his pitching staff? No, I mean, especially since we don't even know where Lynn's going to pitch. That's Correct. part of it. That, that, that's... Um, so let's focus then back on the offense. He's added Kyle Seeger, Guriel... And oh, Eric Cosme. Uh oh. All right. We're gonna have to take a timeout. 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 And we're back. My bad. Forgot to turn my sound uh, off. That's okay. All right. So he's adding Lance Lynn, Lance McCullers, Kyle Seeger, mm -hmm. Yuli Gurriel, Eric Hosmer. Mm -hmm. Now to add those guys, he lost guys. He lost Buster Posey, yeah. Dominic Smith. Bradley Zimmer, Michael Fulmer, DJ LeMayhew, and that's it. I have the same guy twice. Okay. Um, my opinion is, I don't think he, I don't think he picked up any ground. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't. Maybe, maybe it's a little bit better offensively this year, but again, that's not what I would have done. I would have I would have tried to get younger and try to to rehash. What are, what are your thoughts? Like I said, I'm I think I'm higher on this team than you are. Um, he is. I, I think Hosmer and Guriel first base are improvements. If we're now talking about his projected lineup. Um, yeah, well, is Guriel going to hit seventh or eighth in that stacked lineup though? You know True. what I mean? True. I mean, where is he going to hit? But it's the Houston mm -hmm. lineup. Guys are always on base. No? Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I'd like to see what Simmons does. I think Simmons should be a shortstop, not story. Yeah. Yeah, I would agree with that. I think Seager is an improvement over Nunez. No, it depends. Nunez yeah. doesn't have a team. Yeah, well, he'll get a team. I know, right. But, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. You and I differ on how we like his outfield. With Mazzara, Adam Jones, Adam Eaton, Suspedes, and... That is true. Together. Having Eaton back could be a huge deal. I mean, that is kind of an addition. Um, right. Even though we didn't have to give up anything. To yeah, play. I would agree with that. Um, you still got Carlos Martinez, Sonny Gray, Lynn, Davies, Bundy, Sanchez, Faria, and McCullers now is his rotation. Mm -hmm. but, but there again, what makes that substanti substantially better to make the playoffs this year? I'm going to go back to the last point I told you. Better GMing. Okay. I think roster-wise, and I've said this on the text thread, if I had this roster, I could make the playoffs. Mm, okay. I think I could make the playoffs. Okay. Just GMing. Not saying his GMing is bad. Uh, no, that's just, what he said. You no, 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 no. I'm not saying it's not bad. Good. I'm saying, and he knows this, he no. doesn't spend as much time on it. He sets his lineup, and that's all he does. Uh, well, no, he's, he's, he's very work. active in the in the text thread recently. He says a lot of stuff. He doesn't have a choice. He's part of the text thread. So oh, you so, have he, to so you have. Uh, well, yeah, but he he responds. He does. All right. Well, anyway, 
So, so we we will agree to disagree on. So you think he is better than he is last year? The roster's better because that's basically all we're talking about here. You, you can't get into his GM. That's a different. Right, right. right. Um, you know what I'm saying, do you think the roster is better now than it was three months ago? I think it's I think it's a slight push. Um, I do think he did get slightly better offensively. Okay, slightly. I would say I would say that I would agree with that, but I still don't think it's good enough. Let's let's, let's go with that. And now uh, this is going to be weird, isn't it? Okay. All right. So we got to just change to all rise. Is that where we're going? That's where we're going to go, but um, we're, we're, the website is down for some reason. Now we're having technical difficulties. This is the worst video ever. I'm sure <laughs> Globo Jim is going to bitch about it in the first, complain about it in the first <laughs> five minutes. We'll have to pause again. Oh, come on. I'm going to have to change my... Uh, Jeez. Which Wi-Fi I'm connected Come to. on. My bad, number two. Oh, goodness.